Properties of the roots of quadratic equations. If x1 and x2 are the roots of ax square plus bx plus c equals to 0, then find the relation between the roots and coefficients of the equation. Well, we are given x1 and x2 as roots of the equation. That means x minus x1 and x minus x2 are factors of the equation, right? And if we multiply them, we should get the equation itself. That is to say that the given equation ax square plus bx plus c equals to 0 can also be written as x minus x1 times x minus x2 equals to 0 if x1 and x2 are roots of the equation. That's what it means. So since these two equations are equal, let's expand the factored form and equate roots with the coefficients. x times x gives us x square and then x times minus x2 will be minus x2x and then we have minus x1 times x as minus x1x and the minus and minus becomes plus and we get the product of two roots x1 and x2 equals to 0. Now we can factor x then we get x square minus x2 plus x1 when we factor x and here we have the product of the two roots x1 x2 equals to 0. Now if you compare the given equation with the expanded form what do we see? We see that the center term is equals to b but well here we have a but the coefficient is 1. So what we will do is we'll factor out a and then compare the coefficients. So let's factor a from this equation. So what do we get? From here we get a when factored out we get x squared plus b over ax plus c over a equals to 0. Well we can divide both sides by a so we basically have x square plus b over a x plus c over a equals to 0. Now we can compare, right? So let's compare the coefficients of x. The coefficient of x is b over a. And how about the constant terms? We have x1, x2 and the constant term is c over a. So what we can equate from here is that minus of x1 plus x2 is equals to b over a, right? And the product x1 and x2 is equals to c over a. So that is how they are related. And we can write the equation also in terms of sum and product of the roots. So we can say the quadratic equation will be x square minus sum of roots. times x plus product of root. equals to 0. So that becomes our equation, correct? So let me just highlight this equation here. So we basically get an equation like x square minus sum of roots times x plus product of roots equals to 0 if we are given the roots. And the relation between the roots and the coefficient is that sum of roots is equal to b by a, which we can also write as, let me rewrite this as sum of roots x1 plus x2 is equal to minus b by a. That's better. So we'll highlight that portion as product of roots is c by a and sum of roots is minus b by a. So that is how roots and coefficients for a quadratic equation are related. Now we are going to apply this in some problems and see how useful this is. Thank you.